Regiment. There's the second group of uh, one, two, three, four, five. Starting with Philip Dutton and Z, who's a World uh, World Games competitor. Uh, Olympian Jessica Phoenix and some uh, perennial U.S. team members, Allison Springer and Buck Davidson. Here we see uh, Doug Payne and Van Diver. Recently, uh, he won the three-star division at uh, Stableview. I think Doug entered that just to get the horse's feet wet after a, a bit of a hard run at Burley. He was looking quite good until... He got to the maltings and uh, and came to grief there. Many, many, many horses. Very tough burly this year. It was a couple of, about a month and a half ago. This is a lovely horse. It's a 15-year-old Tricaner gelding, owned by Debbie Crowley and ridden by Doug Payne. Nice straight entry. Good strike off. Nice positioning in the shoulder in. Doug strikes a really handsome picture. He sits well in the horse. That's a good good harmony with the horse. You see the nice collection in the corner. The horse almost comes off the ground a little bit better in the turns. Nice positioning in the half pass. Good swing. See a nice smooth change of bend here. That's far quite good. Once you finish a lateral movement, you want to go forward afterwards, reestablish that forward pace. Nice bounce and suspension in the corner. Just coming a little bit behind the vertical as he heads into shoulder in. And then I'll go forward again in medium. Nicely done. The objective here is at this point in the comp competition, you want to see the riders ride a really clean test. No breaks, no mistakes. Can show a little bit more difference between the medium and extension. We'd like to see more of that. Nicely done. Nice balanced transition back to walk. Very good. This walk tour is really complicated. We go from medium walk to collected walk to pirouette left to medium walk to extended walk. Be able to see every single change. It's a very technical movement to get the pirouette. So there's no loss of rhythm. You really hear the wind whipping up there. And you'll see from H, he's got to be an extended walk. Longer frame coverage, covering more ground. Look for a good overreach in the hind leg, which maintains a really good rhythm. Nice. Here we come back to medium walk, and again we do the same thing in this direction. Medium walk, collected walk, pirouette right, and then a right lead canter departure. So all of that has to be done with very good rhythm, stability. This is really catching the horses out today. So many of them lose the rhythm and get tense. Doug really took his time and presented that well. Very patient in the ring. You only get that kind of patience when you're very experienced and you know that waiting that extra beat is going to make the horse that much better. Very nice canter rhythm. I'd like to see a little bit more balance in the counter canter. Nice and straight. Lovely flying change. When you have a change that, that is that straight and rhythmic and norm and, and nice, you kind of want to see the horse give you a little bit more expression so we can go from what is a 7 or a 7.5 and go for the 8. Nice extension there in collection. We shouldn't see a lot of pull from the rider's hands or shouldn't be rigid against the mouth. A little bit of inaccuracy with the horse's neck bend. I guess to work to keep the horse on the outside rein, on the left rein, with his inside leg, not counter bending through the turn too much. 
Yeah, a little too much counter bend coming through and the horse kicked out at his spur. That would be the only mistake in the entire test I've seen so far. Nicely forward here. And then nice collection, very good. Bandiver has a tendency 